The helicopter line has come a long way since those early days. Its dedication to tourism is giving our visitors a chance to experience New Zealand's beauty in a great variety of exciting ways. And one of those ways takes us back to Queenstown, up the gondola to a specially designed theatre that gives you a total audio-visual experience. The helicopter line proudly presents Kiwi Magic. I'm sorry, uh, Billy T. James is my name. What does the T stand for? Well, tour guide, of course. And as you can see, a modestly successful one. But I haven't always been successful, eh? Haven't you? Nah, nah. See, to get my start in business, I had to find a really good mark. I mean, a very important person. Well, now, you see that guy there? A happy, tanned and relaxed tourist if I ever saw one. Well, that's Roscoe P. Barnes. Now, Roscoe was my very important person. You might say was the turning point in my career. Now, when I first met Roscoe, he was a... He was one of those guys who could take a vacation without taking a vacation, you know what I mean? Can I get you anything else at all? Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is your captain here again on the flight deck. I hope you've had a comfortable night. Well, I guess you won't be needing those after this trip's over, huh? All that oh, sun and fun? Uh, we'll shortly be These ways, that's what the brochure says. Yeah. Ma'am, if my uh, figures are correct, I may not even be going past the airport. Well, that'll be a real shame. <laughs> Thank you for flying here, New Zealand. I hope we can see you all again soon. Now, things had been tough for me, eh? Well, I had to take on those big flash tour companies single-handed, and it wasn't easy. But deep down inside, I always knew that fate would take a hand. And maybe an arm or a leg as well. So it's six dollars and fifty-five cents with a one-point issue with pot. That's one thousand eight hundred and one dollars per stockholder. Okay, that's it. That's it. It's always darkest before the dawn, eh? And you never know when old opportunity is gonna notch. <laughs> that's right. We blend the computer division and a whole new joint company. Partner, right? I'm on a vacation. Listen, I know how to take, take a, a vacation. vacation. I'm on one of these, uh... Uh... 
Hey, uh, uh, excuse me, friend. Uh, excuse me. Yokas. Yeah, um, did you see what happened to that bus? Which one were you on? You got a voucher? Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, them. Nah, they'll be long gone by now, mate. Tell you what, we could catch them at One Tree Hill. Nah, they'd only stop there for a living of me. I'll tell you what we'll do. Great South Road to Hamilton. We'll cut off at Narawahi towards Raglan. We'll take the Tikawini Road towards Rupehu. Money is no problem, OK? I don't care what it takes. <sighs> Let's get going. Just get me back to that tour. Right. What? Ever been down this part of the world before, Mr. Uh, sorry, oh, sorry. Uh, no, I haven't. No? Well, maybe I should explain. See, this isn't the regular route. Route? Uh, route. Right. Tighten these belts up here. They gotta be really tight. Just in case we go up so well, they gotta be tight, that's all. You right? Give us a thumbs. Beauty. Hey, you're fine, Mr. 
must have been. Not since the war. <laughs> I've been too busy making money. So how does it feel? Not bad, not bad at all. Been a hell of a long time, though. I've always wondered how one of these old freaks would handle it. Okay, I'll take it from here, Mr. B. Rusta. Rusta. Rusta! <laughs> Negatory on that, Billy. Let me have just one more dance with this old girl before we take her down. What do you say? Okay. It's all yours, mate. Straight down. Straight down. If you work for me, Billy, I'd have fired you by now. 
But this place that you got here is beautiful. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. It's beautiful. Well, you know, Oscar, we accept American Express, Visa, Master Chat. <laughs> Cash? You <a> stranger? <laughs> That's it. See, they get ferried up onto the glacier down there. This is the quickest way down. Oh, the tour. The tour, yeah. Oh. Ah, yeah. uh, uh, Billy, uh... uh yeah. i tell you what. If it makes you feel better, you can be the brake man in the back there. Ah! Oh, okay. Okay, good. Let's go.
I've used the radio and I've found the tour. It's fixed up. We'll be there in no time. What do you mean? We gotta leave? See that down there? Well, this is your last stop, Mr. Barnes. This is Walter Peak Station. Mr. Barnes? Mr. Barnes, it really is you! Oh my god, I was so worried. I'm fine. I'm really, no, I'm terrific. I'm fine. You really are, aren't you? Oh, yeah. do come and have a drink. Oh, yeah, right. So have a drink. <laughs> have you had a wonderful time? You look like you've had a wonderful time. <laughs> I've had a wonderful time. Uh, here's to, uh, Having a wonderful, wonderful time. time. Did you go on the glacier? Yeah. It was you. You're in some kind of a raft or something. A sled, I think. A sled? Well, yeah, a bobsled. And we could, couldn't stop. Yeah. I would have. Yeah, well, I wait. Ah, good day. Well, I guess we made it, huh? Roscoe's happy. He's reunited with us, too. I tell you what, I reckon it won't be long before there'll be something going on between Roscoe and that lady, you know what I mean? Oh, that's something I wanted to tell you, too. Tell See, it. Roscoe. Come on. I've got some clients lined up. We got this tour company, see? Billy T. Barnes, adventurers, uh, purveyors of adventure, equal partners, something like that. <laughs> it's Tuesday, Billy. Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Tuesday, right. Tuesday. Not quite equal. You see, every Tuesday he's got to have the hat. Yeah. Well, let's go. Cool. What about your friend? Is she She's coming along. OK. You, uh, you kind of like this lady, don't you, uh, Roscoe? Yeah. She's not going to affect the business. No, no, you? no. Business is going to be great. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah. Well, I talk to her. There's a possibility, you know, of her staying in, uh, what do you call it down here? What, in country? In country. That's serious, sir. Yeah. This is R.P. Barnes. Put me through to J.D. 
One moment, please. Bart! Just the man. Now, about that federal deal... Hold I... up, J.D. I'm not coming back. I'm staying on in New Zealand. I've decided to settle here. Yeah, but... J.D., you're gonna have to find yourself another boy. Bart! Roscoe! Buddy! Today.